Hey, this is Jenny Jones, Digital Growth Hacks Club. Listen, I'm here with dynamic mockups. Now, I know what you're saying. I know what you're thinking. Jenny, we've seen one mockup tool. We've seen them all. Like, no, nah, I don't think you've seen this one. Hey, if this is your first time to this channel, please go ahead and like, subscribe. I'm always coming up with these different hacks, putting tools together, gluing them together, making them work like peanut butter and jelly. So that is my story. All right. So, and if any tools that I show you here that you like, just click on the link below. You can get a 60 day money back guarantee. Uh, no questions asked. Um, but this is from AppSumo. Again, AppSumo is a platform that allows you to connect with founders trying to get their products established and they want people to purchase their product for a lifetime license and grow with the company. So AppSumo came up with this. This is this did not hit AppSumo a lot of fanfare, but I don't know why. And so let me tell you, well, let me let me read to you what I wrote. Right. Uh, before I get into that, I just want to show you guys what I wrote. Right. So it's bootstrap, boost, bootstrapped, started in 2023, United Kingdom. This is what I wrote. I said, hey, listen, this tool is not to be played with. You have been warned. Right. And I'm going to add more to this. There's so much more I want to be able to tell you. I just can't tell you right now. I am going to show you something that is a must have this that would make this a must have tool on your shelf. It says this is not your run of the mill mock up shop. This tool was built with intent. And the reason why I say that is because you can tell the things that they put together and why things connect. Right. So I have more to follow up on this tool. I can promise you this. Right. So I'm letting you know I've already I've taken it out for a spin. I've been working with it for a couple of days now. And I already know what I want to do with this tool. I'm just not ready to show the world and everyone yet. It says this tool is not to be played with. You can do a lot of damage with this tool. I will have a lot to say in a few weeks about this tool when I showcase it. So I'm going to do a full showcase showcase, but I wanted to give you a couple of the pieces of the puzzle today and something that really actually I was going to hold off, but I say, you know what? Let me show them this one piece. And when I show you this one piece, you're going to like, oh, I like that. Right. And I'm going to show you a little hack that I did because I don't pull tools out unless I got a hack in the oven. Right. And you guys should know me by now. If you don't, you need to follow this channel, man. There's no telling what I may come up with. You have been warned not to sleep on this tool. I'm letting you know. So you can't come back later and say, hey, Jenny, you didn't tell me. No, I'm telling you. Right. So some will see it right away and others will let it pass. You can't say I didn't tell you very tight on credits. But I get it nowadays. Gone are the days of the you get a car, you get a car, you get a car. But I'm letting people know you've been warned. Effortless create someone saying effortless creation and tons of fun. Let's see what some of the three taco people are saying. Just so you know, mock up anything tested. Interesting base needs real template power. So this has potential, right? And I'm going to show you the reason why. So what you can do is you can come here. And I think some of the questions were, how many credits do I get a month? Well, you get 100 credits a month. Um, it eats, eats pretty good. Anywhere between two to three credits depends on what it is that you're, you're developing, right? So the first one, you don't get the API. You don't get embedded mock-up editor and white labeling. Only do not get, if you're just going to use this for personal private use, then yeah, this is good. If you want to get this and kind of turn like a quasi business into this, I would say either get a tier one for yourself or get a tier three, right? Tier three. So tier three has white labeling, embedding, mock-up editor, and API. That's very important to know. Now these available add-ons, I think this is something that you can get uh, initially, but you're going to get a thousand uh, credits a month with this particular setup for 249. You can't beat that. I think it runs anywhere between $59 to $99 a month for this tool. You're going to get this to lifetime credits. Um, no watermark, bulk downloads, unlimited manual downloads, um, custom Photoshop mockups. There's about 1,000 plus mockups in here, Photoshop integration. Those things are important, right? So I'm going to show you one thing here that no one is talking about. They have a, it's called mock up anything. I think that's what it's called. It's called mock up anything that's included. So this is the regular mock up stuff. And I'm going to show you 
most of it here, but I'm going to, only thing I'm going to concentrate on, I'm going to show you the tool really quick. I, I owe you that. I'm going to show you the tool really quick. Then I am going to show you mock up anything. If you don't do anything else, you get this tool for the mock up anything, right? And I think our challenge now is, oh, I don't think I need mock ups anymore. I have the, the, the GPTs and those can do all that. But yeah, when you want consistency and you want to put something out, you definitely want to do that. But I, I took the mock up anything, mixed it with another tool and made two other tools. Listen, I, I, I'm, that's all I'm going to say on that. I do have something very, very big coming for this tool. I do not want to get into that right now over this video, but I'm going to walk you through it and I'm going to show you what I actually did. All right. So stand by, let me log in. All right. So just like any other mock-up you would mock in, I think what I like about their mock-up is every time you log in, you don't see the same mock-ups. They're just giving you a wall of different types of mock-ups that you can use or you can choose from. What you do is you click on it and he says, Hey, I want to edit this mock-up or I want to edit this mock-up. Right. Um, so of course I tested it out and I immediately went to tier three cause I saw something ah, oh, ding, ding, ding. And got a flash, got a vision on that. Um, so what I want to show you is again, this is regular. Let's, let's see what I have. Let's, let's go here and let's go to edit this mock-up, right? And you go edit this mock-up here. Then you add your, you add your, um, uh, artwork here. So we'll go right here. I'll go add art mark. This is one that I had the other day. That I did. I don't know if you guys saw that. That's a whole nother story. No one even got that. Some people got it. Some people didn't. Um, so this is my mock up here. So I just add it here. You just add it here and you can make a larger, you can move it up some, let me move it up some, see if it works out better. So a lot of people want to see their mock ups, right? So we have that, that's the mock up there. And then when you're done, you just download it. You can download it in the different sizes here, 720, 1080, 1048. And jpeg png and web pm so and then you just download from there right and then you um so you can do that and you can change the color if you want you can add the color um you can make any other adjustments in the virus opacity so and then you have a true blend ai here that you can kind of mix in there so if i wanted to change the color let me see if i could change the color so I can make the shirt blue if I wanted to, right, and so on and so forth. So you get you get the you get the gist of it there. That's not the that. So what I like about this this is one very um, customizable. You can do some different things here. That's just one thing, and it has direct integration with Etsy, or it has direct integration with uh, I think Shopify and WooCommerce as well. So these are just some of the things that I was messing around with. I put together, but here's where the, 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 the true. Now I'm going to show you, I got to show you another photo cause I have to show you that originally what it was. So this is create a mock-up, right? And we're going to look at it here. See how it came back up. The library is different. Now I have different choices here and you can use, um, a PSD, uh, Photoshop mock-up. But what you can do is you can come here and go, you know what? I want to create a mock-up just off of scratch. And this is beta, right? So you can come here and you can say, hey, a three short, three fourth shot of a woman wearing a blank t-shirt. Let's see how that looks. So I'm going to put a um, three fourths woman wearing a t-shirt at the beach. So I'll, I'll just, a woman, I'll put a, a, let me put African. I always test that, right? I always see if, can I change that ethnicity? African-American, three-fourth woman wearing a t-shirt at the beach. So we'll go like this. And we'll see what it get. Now, the, the best part I like about this is they built in the prompt. It's here. That's why I said this is built. This is built with intent. They know what they're doing here, right? So we'll use this one here. So here's a woman here. So you can do, you can change her pose, right? She's at the, you can change her pose, right? Um, you can change the scene, 
right? Or something like that. So you can do these different things. And then this was built with intent. I'm telling you right now, because when you see that like that and it does that, so that's that. So then I can say, Hey, if I use this, now I can put my logo on this if I wanted to, but I can change it. Let's change the scene to a studio. This is, this is serious right here. This is, so now you can take your mock-ups and kind of be creative with the mock-ups that you do. So that cost me to create her cost me three credits, it cost me three credits. So I changed it to a studio shoot. Uh, that took one credit. Let me change it to an urban street. I don't like the brown t-shirt, but I could probably change that when I go back to look. So this, you have to see the vision in a tool that allows you to with this much flexibility. Some of the older tools, actually a lot of the older tools, just not going to give you that. See now how I changed it to an urban street. And when I change the scenery, that took a couple of different credits there. So you can do that. Let me change her look. Um, ethnicity, you can change the look. Um, we can go here. We can go with a bob cut. Let's give her a bob cut. That was 987. So when you start experimenting around, you start getting into your, that's why it almost makes sense to get the thousand dollars, the thousand credits. Cause you can start chewing through these credits and you can see that right there. I just switched her hair to a Bob. This is sick, right? So if I had her facing me, I could be able to put a t-shirt on her, but let me show you what I did. So this is what I have now and I can just download this. This is done. I can download this. I can put my mock-up on it, but this is mock-up anything. So I can actually um, mock up anything, but let me show you how this works where the power of this tool works. So let me get out of this and I'm gonna show you what I did. So this is one that I have here that I've created. Um, and so let me go back. Okay, so let me go back into the create a mock-up and let me show you what I actually did as I wrap up here. All right, so what I did here in this particular photo, this is a photo of El Grove where I live and some other stuff here. And I like this sign. I've been using this sign um, quite frequently in my demos for my Brilliant Directory. So I showed people how I built the Brilliant Directories here and all that other stuff, right? So I like this sign so much that I wanted to move the sign and still use the sign. So what the next video I'm gonna show you, I took this photo, moved it with the mock-up anything so you can go into mock up anything and I can move this sign wherever I want to. I can move it in the studio. I can move it on the beach. I can move it in the park. So you're going to see the next little short 10 second video that I did. Um, that's exactly what you can do with this particular um, tool with the mock up anything. I really like that. They are credit hungry, but I'm okay with that. I think I don't know that I'm going to buy additional credits, but I wouldn't mind paying for this monthly. So I'm gonna have to figure out what I'm gonna do. I may just have my, my, I may just have my LTD or I may just buy another LTD. I don't know. I'm not, sh not sure yet. I just kind of like what I can do with this and the flexibility. I'm going to show you later why I'm probably going to either buy two or just subscribe to them monthly. And I'll, I'll show you later. I'm not going to get into that right now, but you will see, you got to stay tuned. All right. So let me show you. So, all right. So. Let's take a look at that. All right, so there you have it. This is dynamic mockups. I like this, right? You have an embed editor here. Um, you can actually mock this, put this in, they give you embed code. You can do some other stuff. You guys already know. I don't even want to get into it, but anyway, all right. So that's what we have here. So I really like to see how every time you load it, it gives you different inspirations and you can say, Oh, I like this mock-up. Let me do this mock-up mock-ups still do well. Right. But now you can see what I just showed you in my, uh, in the video, you can do a lot with that, right? You can do a lot with this and you're still telling your story. That's where we're at right now. Right.
hey, you guys have been great. Thank you for checking us out. Make sure you use the code below. If you like me, if you want me to continue to give you these ideas and different things like that, go ahead and support the channel. Um, anything that you guys do, I'm always going back and I'm just putting it back into the channel because I want to make this channel more for you guys and to give you guys ideas and inspirations. And that's what I do. I do a lot of the use cases here and I do a lot of the hacks together. So if you want to continue to do that, also use just use the code below. Also, make sure you guys join me for my second annual um, Black Friday. Um, it's a Black Friday, my Black Friday deal room. So inside my deal room, founders show up, uh, people show up, they show off what their some of their new tools are. They kind of walk you through some of the things they want you to know about some of the improvements they made. And they take some of your questions and they take some of the feedbacks and your ideas. So that happens. Uh, this is my second year doing that. Um, tickets will be available for that. If you belong to this channel in, in any type of capacity, you know, I'm already going to give you a discount. Um, but if you don't belong to this channel, this would be a good opportunity to belong to the channel because I'm always doing discounts for my channel members and my community members. They already know they're taken care of. All right. So you guys have been great. See you guys later. See you in the next one. Goodbye for now.